Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, welcome back to the show. It's Ozzy Medias 3630, and the Packers are still playing the 49ers. And Marquez Valdez Scantling has just caught his second touchdown. I had to turn the game off because, ugh, he's been so garbage lately. It's how are you supposed to predict that the dude is going to freaking go off for two touchdowns? Against one of the best defenses in the league. Uh, I knew Adams was going to have a good game. There was no way to predict that Scantling would have a good game. Oh well. That's frustrating. Uh, I was up pretty good money. I'm barely making any money now. but So I had to turn it off, take a little breather. And take a look at the Ford Raptor Ranger. 49ers are getting blown out too, man. Uh... Ford Ranger Raptor. Oh, there's the RS200. That's the car I was supposed to tune up. Hmm. Maybe it was the Hoonigan one I was supposed to tune up with that. Whatever. thought I had a Ranger Raptor. Guess I need to buy one. Sounds fun to me. Let's go buy one. So... The auto show, browse them all, and skip down to the forwards. I can't spell. There they are. Ford Ranger Raptor, fifty-eight grand D four ninety-eight. I believe I saw a D event. That is a sweet, sweet truck. Uh, I think. Black on black looks dope. How about you? And Ford Ranger Raptor. That is sweet. The Ranger Raptor. 60 grand. It's a lot of money. Not for a Raptor though, I guess. I like it. <sighs> All right. I think the game is twenty-eight to three because I uh, just got some old Falcons jokes coming across my uh, text message in here. So I think, like I said, that there is a event for D class. D crap. D class trucks right now. Let's just take a look see at that in the playlist. So the chapter one in the weekly Force Athon challenge is Own and Drive the 19 Ranger Raptor. Ride into the Ranger Zone. Air skills and wreckage skills. Ten crash landings. Huh. In your Ranger Raptor. That sounds like fun on a bun. But also. C600 off road. So I think we can qualify for this. I'll tune the Raptor up to C600 and then drive on over there, right? The Raptor should be C600. I mean, it's a D class now. Should be off road, I would think. Welcome home to the Castle View Road. Let's tune it up. know me and the way I tune I like it all wheel drive so good we're already there like a nice lightweight engine but I think it said C600 right so we could do that if we wanted 599 498 well, that puts you right there at the bottom of it. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Just keep the stock motor. 
Um, let's see if we can take some weight out. Yeah, that's better. Keep taking weight off. And get some brakes on there. You add in the brakes, it also takes a lot of weight off. So I'll take it. It's a lot for two pounds off and no anything else. Not gonna do that at all for four four class points. I'm definitely not gonna put the uh, roll bars in there. Check out the transmission. We'll put that in there because usually when you add to the, oh, it doesn't look like it's doing anything now. When you put stuff, when you put. Uh, in, horsepower into the motor that's when the transmission actually starts to matter so I plan on doing some upgrades to the motor so that will eventually matter yeah it's not gonna touch that that's probably all we can do here right there 592 trying to get to 600 exactly to compete in uh, win a beginner truck. Yeah, too much there. Let's, let's change the rims, maybe. Put some off road tires. Damn. Beef up the tires a bit. Push them all the way out. and change the rims to make them lighter. Like that. Maybe a little bit of aero. Yeah, fuck it, why not, right? Absolutely not. And no thank you. Alright, so that's it. Right there at C600, which is where we're trying to go anyways. Save the setup as... Beginner Truck. That's the name of the event. Beginner Truck. That's the name of the tune. And that's what I'm putting in here. Uh, saving the file name for that tune as Beginner Truck. I don't think that you can actually see this part. That's why I'm telling you what I'm doing. And this one is for, it's best for handling really, and we'll say a little bit of advertising, still, an FAC on switch. Excuse me a moment while I do some advertising, we'll get to the racing very soon. Eventually I'll go ahead and make a better tune like a higher class tune for this truck but for now why not leave it right here I don't have many 600 vehicles anyways maybe I'll buy another Ranger Raptor and tune that one up to ARS class see how it does excuse me so that's it let's go in the 19 Ranger Raptor tuned up to C600 it's Ozzy Medias 3630 is the gamer tag Still an FAC on Twitch and not fooling around crew on YouTube. I'd like to add me on all those channels. That's where you'll find me. Message center says bit. Alright, now let's see. Where do we have to go? Home festival playlist. And the beginner's truck right there c600 off-road i didn't check to see if this is off-road but it has to be an off-road truck so we're just going to assume where it is and drive the hell on over there safe to do so in 200 yards turn left oh that's nice turn left slow as balls but nice
That's pretty cool, like, uh, speedometer, huh? For the attack. I like it. It's a combination of digital and analog. Looks cool. It's funny to see the Ford truck when the, with the steering wheel on the wrong side, but when in, when in Britain. Am I right? So here we go. Being very polite taking this off-road vehicle on roads. It's a polite kind of night. Unless you're the 49ers fans. Man, it has been just an absolutely brutal season for the 49ers. After doing so well last year to just having so many disastrous injuries on top of injuries. On top of poor quarterback performances. Like, it's just been a really strange... Jimmy Garoppolo can't get right, and Kyle Shanahan's just like switching quarterbacks willy nilly. Not willy nilly, but he's giving him a short hook for sure. Well, you know, he's uh, he's got the pull to be able to do it. He's got the pedigree. Remember his father was like the king of fantasy running backs. Uh, him and Marty Schottenheimer. You had a Marty Schottenheimer back. You knew you were getting 30 touches a game in all the goal line books. But it's neither here nor there. Right now we're in the Ranger Raptor. Just enjoying a nice little winter drive. It is slow as fudge. But it drives well in the snow. Or in the icy roads. Got a big ass tire on this bad boy. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to make this thing jump and crash, right? I so I better take it off road. Gotta give the people what they want. Recalculating route. And by the people, I mean the people right. who make Forza and tell me what to do with these challenges. Turn left. Thing's awesome off road for sure. This is kind of fun. It's slow enough that you can like maneuver without smacking into every tree. That's always fun. Usually these cars are so damn fast to take it off road, you're just fudged. This is me editing my language. There uh, we go. Let's uh, place first against highly skilled driver tars, number 37 Pro 2 truck. Let's get, get, so, get it. even though it's freezing out there, we've still got loads of people braving the weather to watch this seasonal. I don't suppose that has anything to do with you, does it? Oh, it's always it, I mean, it's kind of embarrassing. I feel bad for it. Oh man, I must have streamer mode on or off. Dang it, that's going to cost me some uh, minutes my uploads uh yeah everything i do on twitch gets uploaded to the youtube channel that's not fooling around crew on youtube it's not fooling is my first name there's no spaces not fooling is one word and around crew is the last name so uh, everything i do on twitch gets uploaded to the youtube channel and the youtube channel uh you have in-game music you get flagged Uh, it's 1200 followers there, and they're, they're basically been there for a long time. I, I have a YouTube channel for a very long time. I used to play Racing Rivals, and if you've uh, listened to my shows before, you've heard this story. Racing Rivals was a mobile game by Glue, and it used to be with Pinks. They don't support the game anymore, the game's disappeared. But it was a lot of fun when it did last, and if you've never Pinks, dick. If you've never Pinks, a digital car. <laughs> He'd never lived because it can get intense. It can make you aggravated. 
Jeez, this is awful, huh? I'm not catching up to nobody. It's alright. Maybe I tuned this up just slightly wrong. We'll see. I didn't go for speed at all, and I, I think that's normally an okay thing. Because this will hand be handle better than their vehicles, but it, this has been more or less a straight course. But yeah, here we go. You know, if it's more or less a straight course and handling isn't going to do much for gays. Here we go. Catching up now. Love this course. This is so fun. That berm that we just rode on. This is the fun one. This is a really fun course. Awesome. This is a fun course. Yeah. I really like this game a lot. I do. This game is like the perfect combination for me. And that's how we take first place before the end of the race. Perfection. Never once had to let off the gas or use the brakes, I don't think. Shit, here we go. Here we go. Look out, dogs. Those are dogs, I think. Maybe ducks. I don't know. Heard them barking. Ah, they said. So, uh, yeah, the last I checked, uh, the game was getting so frustrating. Uh, I was, I, I thought the Niners, man, it just, I've been so wrong about the Niners all year. I thought the Niners would do better. I thought Mullins would do better than he's playing. The Ni Niners have a good defense, but Rodgers is just lighting them up. I mean, he does that from time to time, just goes off. But I did not expect Mark, I did not expect MBS to go off. Predictably, uh, Dante, Devontae, Adam, Devontae Adams is having a great game, but I did not expect to see MBS have two touchdowns. He was playing like garbage, too. He dropped some easy passes, and then he just, I don't know, busted coverage. He's wide open in the end zone for a long bomb, and after that, it's just another one for good measure just to piss me off, I guess. So I had to turn the game off after that. Uh, where are we going? Where is the next event? Do you see it? I don't see it. Uh, there's one way over there, and here's one here. Man, they're far apart, huh? Let's get it. Where am I going? So. We are not. <laughs> uh, I get a little bit of pleasure out of this for real, just driving around, <laughs> bouncing this truck all around and fudging it up. Come on, what are you doing? Oh, goodness. Get off your two wheels. Uh, what to do with it? There we go. Let's try again. Bounce it for me. Oh, shit. So, yeah. Uh, just love this game so much. Right? That snow is coming after me. It's like vanilla skies up there. Oh, we don't need no stinking roads. I guess it's Recalculating. Tell you one thing about the uh, 600 truck here. It's simple to drive. If you're uh, new to the game, this might be a good truck to start with because it's just... Forgiving for sure. Turn left. Mm 
Welcome to the Horizon event. Please keep your arms and legs in the vehicle at all time. And do not stand up and put your head out the sunroof if you value the top of your dome. Let's go off road, right? Here for it's good. Super far apart between races. It's kind of irregular. Recalculating route in 400 yards. Go ahead and recalculate for me, sweetheart. Bad. Yeah. In 400 yards. Awesome. Turn left. I came in like a wrecking ball. Yeah. Turn left. In 100 yards. Turn left. Here we go. You have arrived at your destination. So five five six two five six eight eight six four six two five one five five. It's got a higher top speed, much less acceleration and braking. I wonder if I had not put so much into the braking, maybe we could have put some more into the top end. You certainly don't need that much braking when you're going so freaking slow. Um, that's something I'll do next. Right, right after this race if I can get to the house before the next race I will stop by the house and update the tune take some of that braking off and put it into the motor I mean if you're not moving fast you don't need to be able to brake hard so I like it for taking the weight off but certainly feels like lacking a little bit in top end uh, That said, it's that said, it's good. It's good enough, right? I mean, it's gonna get even better on these horses where it's required to turn a lot. The reason I tune with um, and take the weight off. And with emphasis in handling over or top end, it's because you can get higher average speed. Uh, you can take the turns at speed, and your truck is lighter, you can get faster acceleration. It goes for cars too. It's easier to accelerate, the truck is lighter, um, you can take higher speed turns, you can get better handling. And you may not have the fastest overall speed on the track, but you'll have the fastest average speed across the entire track, and that leads to faster lap times, faster races, and easier races, uh, simply. Um, if the car handles and drives better, it's easier to drive. You know, it sounds obvious. Matters. I mean, if the car is too fast, it becomes difficult to drive. If it doesn't have the proper handling or braking, you know, as good as speed, if you can't keep it from hitting the wall or keep it from jumping all over the track or out there twerking across the road. Here we go. I mean, you can see this truck is just dominating the driver cars. Not that they were like competitive to begin with, but on the last track it was a lot more um, straightaways. This one's a lot more turning. You just 
see the difference. Took almost the entire race before I got into first place. The last time didn't take much of the much of the first lap, and this time I haven't seen anybody since. Are they either back there somewhere? Ozzy Medias, 36.30 is the gamer tag. I uh, do a lot of daily fantasy sports. And uh, for those who aren't familiar, it's uh, like you. I, don't know if you if you're, I guess if you've never played fantasy football, you're not going to be familiar with daily fantasy sports. But uh, how do you describe this to somebody who doesn't? basically gambling on a football game where you pick individual players instead of a team because that's the best way to put it and uh, you have a team of individual players not the actual team anyway so I play a lot of DFS and so I take a lot of notes and I do a lot of studying and uh, I do some videos where I, I race and I talk about the teams that are playing tonight and uh, that night I did do one of those about the Packers and the 49ers tonight who are playing right now. So I need some green boots. Can't wait. All right, let's see if we can find a house on the way to the last event. Last event is here, and there is no house on the way. Oh, there's a house right here. Jump up in the house, and then I'll head over there. Oopsies. You have arrived at your destination. Welcome to the Gables. Ozzy Mendez, 3630, up in the upper left hand quarters, a gamer, gamer tag. So like I said, I'm going to go back into the upgrades and I'm going to take the brakes off. It's going to add some weight to the truck. And it hurts a little bit in acceleration in the launch. But hopefully I can make up for that here in the motor. And it does not look like I can. Well, wasn't that a waste of time. Okay, so just put that back in the brakes. It worked well anyways, right? So let's just get the hell out of here. Forget I said anything. And off to the last race. Past Grandma's house. Oh shit. No, I hate when that happens. Do not want to join the dumb M M eliminator shit. God dang it. Crap. If they kick me into eliminator, I'm just going to end the video. I do not want to play that dang eliminator shit. How do you get out of that? Whatever. Definitely gonna bring me in there. There's no way to get out of it. It's so dumb. How many times I've done this? I accidentally hit Illuminator. Recalculating route. In 200 yards, turn sharp right. Oopsies! Ha! Like a shockwave killed those other trees. Yeah. Please stop finding an eliminator session. If you know how to stop an eliminator session, hit me up. Let me know how to 
just stop one. This happens to be like this is at least the third time. Get button happy and click happy, I suppose, and just click on the wrong things. Two hundred yards. Turn right. So the, I live in these apartments, and uh, I don't know what happened, but I was walking the dog, or no, I was taking the trash out. I take the dog. I take the dog to the trash, and sometimes it's like, um, like a dumpster, you know, where you take the trash to. So I walk the dog over there, and take the trash out, and somebody stuff is like getting thrown out in the dumpster, not in the dumpster. It was next to the dumpster, but there was like a bow and arrow. There was like two bow and two bow and arrows like new looking shit in a crossbow and it's just sitting in a box next to the trash and there's like somebody's stuff like I don't know if they got evicted or like somebody went to jail or I don't know what happened but all this stuff was like next to the dumpster so I grabbed that fucking crossbow I was like dumpster crossbow you know I'm about that life so I, I grabbed this crossbow and uh, I mean it was great condition I just made sure it was clean it's sitting out in my um it's out in my laundry room right now. Uh, I don't have any arrows for it. I don't even know how to use the damn thing, but it's like a crossbow. I'm not gonna just leave that there. It was in a box. I'm grabbing that bitch for real. So yeah, this is this is how I'm living. Crossbow life. In case you're wondering the type of dude I am, I'm the type of dude who takes a crossbow from the fucking box next to the trash and like brings it home with a uh whatever man you gotta do what makes you happy uh wrap on a stick I guess I'll play this eliminator junk and now quit it that's what you do there we go so right there uh huh don't listen to the music because gonna get me flagged and I can't stand that part of it why do you put music in the game and let me record the game and then flag me for the music when I put the video up on YouTube it's just a uh, frustrating part of the game I am the Eliminator I don't know if you ever played Eliminator uh, I don't really know Alright, I guess. Just gotta drive around and like... You don't have to find cars, but you can. I mean, there's nothing wrong with this Mini, right? And I don't really know what the yellow arrows mean. I guess that's the next closest player. To the yellow line. I think it's a player. Oh yeah, and it's like if a player like drives up next to you and beefs at you, you have to race them somewhere. I don't really know how this should work for real. You're supposed to get somewhere, and the arena gets smaller, um, like, it's like a called Fortnite. Hey, there's a car. You see that purple over there? That's a car. Go get the car. Is it a Lancer? Cool. Turn that car. That's better, huh? So you can go up there, you can beep at people, and then you gotta race them. Might as well do that so I can get out of here because I wasn't planning on playing this game anyways. It's a way better car than I had. Somebody's over here somewhere. I 
I really don't know how to play this game. Ah, oh, here's another car. It's the Panty. I don't really want to race the Panty if I don't have to, right? Turn around when it is safe to do so. I don't know where we're supposed to go. There we go. That's where we gotta go. to get there for sure. Oh shit. That'll do it. That's how you end up that's how you lose a race right there. If I'm going the right way, shit. That's it, I was gonna lose. It's tough to get through these trees, man. There he is, shit, he beat me. Oh, well, you can't win them all, right? If I hit trees, you can't. Good race. And that's the end of that. We hit a tree. Damn it, right behind him. Oh well. Good race. And finally get out of there. So that's how Eliminator works. But, maybe. Probably. Okay. We can hang out, but I can sleep in too. All right. So where's this last reset? miles away from me now, right? Let's go, uh, fast travel there, and then go back to the race. Lizard. And a final race. This is a Ford Ranger Raptor. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Yeah. This is a pretty badass truck too. Do not do more. They are skinny, like you said. That I see one today, and I was like, yeah, they are kind of skinny. I didn't realize it was going to be the kind of They're definitely not small like they used to be.
Oh, thank you. All right, so the last race in the event. Let's go. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, that's a good movie. Back to the Future is a good one. Though still one first place in the championship. And that's good enough to win the um something. Bum, 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 bum. There we go with the epic thirty seven pro two truck. Yeah, let's go check out the media shower, huh? Yeah, probably a good idea. <laughs> so that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. The Ranger Raptor is a pretty good tune. Like I said, it's not a fast one, and it's not going to win you if it's a lot of uh, straight racing, but it's definitely good for okay, off road. Definitely in this class. So uh, thanks for watching. It's Ozzy Mendez 3630. And. Uh, Please sub in to the channels on YouTube and the Twitch channel. It's not fooling around crew on YouTube and still in a on Twitch.